okay rule 4 says that according to the laws of reflection it says that uh, any if the light ray instant on the mirror with some angle it reflects back again in the other direction same angle following the laws of reflection so these rules are very important uh, for forming the ray diagrams now so let's see. Uh, then okay now let us uh, find about that uh, image formation image formation in convex mirror in this one we have only one image one diagram for any position of the object so for example this one convex mirror and we know this is the pole and this is the f and c is the center of curvature so if we keep any object at any point here not a, a, at uh, any point here we get the same image for example this is the object uh, ab and here one light ray of coming like parallel to this one any light ray coming from parallel to the principal axis after reflection it happens to be coming from focus so it reflects back like this and any light ray making some angle like this it reflects back again in this direction so all these light rays are reflected and if I extend these light rays means so the already this extend these light rays means so here they form here image they form here so which is the image called a dash and b dash so in uh, convex mirrors always the image is virtual erect and diminished that you should remember here in convex in these mirrors image is always virtual erect and uh, diminished so always the image is here uh, always the image is uh, virtual in the sense that uh, here the meaning of virtual means the image is formed because of the light uh, not actual light rays but the extended light rays are being intersected here that is the meaning of here virtual means not only that any image formed behind the mirror that will be called as virtual the image is formed before the mirror means that will be real and if the image formed behind the mirror means that will be virtual here therefore in this mirror image is always virtual erect and diminished because of the diminishing region this mirror finds application in automobiles this mirror will be used mostly in automobiles like that is in buses in front of the buses or uh, cars and uh, auto drivers this will be used so here uh, this is the uh, about uh, application so uh, this is about uh, convex mirror so actually there are four rules are there for convex mirror rule 1 rule 2 rule 3 so rule 1 says that parallel beam of light rays of reflection will go appears to be coming from focus rule 1 and rule 2 any light ray coming through focus appears to come coming through focus it will travel parallel to the principal axis and any light ray coming towards the center of curvature reflects back again in the same direction that's about uh, that is normal incidence here we can call this as a normal incidence and rule 4 uh, follows the loss of reflection whatever that angle it makes here if 30 means here also 30 and here it is 40 means here also 40 that also follows that one so in case we may form in convex mirrors like concave mirrors here 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 we are not having the different cases only one case we are having wherever you keep the object here 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 anywhere here we get the same image that is virtual erect and uh, diminished that is small in size so which is the mostly used in uh, automobiles okay thank you